give God glory in this place and get yourself ready to receive from the Lord and from the apostle of this word. Come on, lift up your voice and give it glory right now. Give it praise. Give it praise. A moment ago, a moment ago, Elder Bender had to shout. I'm not an overtly spiritual person. I am a prophetic person. But I'm not an overtly spiritual person. I'm certainly not a religious person. And uh, when you shouted a moment ago, it was as though I was in a where I've been many times in a great outdoor stadium with tens of thousands spilling over into hundreds of thousands. I, please hear me. I I did not hear you shouting. It was it was a very startling thing. Just now. Just now. Stand here. Elder Bendley, Bender simply said, shout. And I know what you're shouting. Sounds like. I know what a shout in this place sounds like. <laughs> I grew up here. Yeah. I helped put those ceiling tiles in place with my own hands. Yeah. I nailed down the roof on the first half yeah. of the 400 seat alcohol myself with my own hands. So I know what it sounds like around here. I know what it sounds like when this place is overflowing, when we have three Sunday services in here, we had to move this all back. Yes, sir. The, the pulpit platform used to go out in here and the choir loft in here. And we had to move all that out of the way because on Sunday morning, I would sit chairs up to this point right here and fill this section in with chairs. And we would open the side doors and set up chairs outside. And we would open those doors back there and the outside doors so that the people that would stand outside by their cars during all three services could listen. I know what that shouts out. Yeah. And what I heard was none of those shouts. And so I'm gonna show you what I heard. You all can, you all can take your seats. I, I want to show you what I heard. Is that all right? Say, I am in a moment. No, say it like you believe it. Say, I'm in a moment. Say, I'm in a moment. Say, I'm in a moment. Right now. All right, be seated. Say, I'm in a moment. Right now. Say it again. Say it again. I'm in a moment. Right now. Can't you talk and sit at the same time? Say, I am in a moment. If you can, you'll never flow in the anointing. Say, I am in a moment. Right now. Right now. The anointing is when the Holy Spirit takes possession of you. That's what the anointing is. The anointing is not a feeling. The anointing is when the Holy Spirit possesses your mind and your body through your spirit. So in times like this, I'm still standing over there watching me over here. You don't understand. You don't understand. Say, I'm in a moment. Some of you need to learn to get acquainted with the anointing because you don't know anything about it yet. But you will know about it. Say, I'm in a moment. Right now. I'm in a moment. Right now. I'm in a moment. Right now. God is a God of season. God is a God of cycle. God is a God of timing. God is a God of moments. God is a God of people. God is a God of places. Stand up. What's your name? What? What? Brika? Marika. Some Mika. Doesn't matter. Right? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Because I'm going to make your tongue as the tongue of the red and rider, says the Lord. I'm going to cause you to declare and decree the law of the Lord. I will see to it. Oh, God said, I will see to your words. That's what he said to me. I will see to your words. Did you hear what God just said to you? God said to you, I, God, will see to your words. God said, I will see to your words. I don't know why you're not responding. Because any word that I give anybody can be your word, but you have to make it your word. God just said to us, I will see to your words. I can't believe that. God said to us, I will see to your words. Everybody else be seated. Everybody else be seated.
to be a threefold increase of your anointing 